Yo, what is up everybody? It is Prestige or Mad Luigi here with another Borderlands, a pre-sequel video, and today we're going to be looking at the Mork, which is a new Legendary Shield uh, released at the same time of the Kleptastic Voyage DLC. And in the Kleptastic Voyage DLC, in one of the new um, areas, there is a spot that you can always get a Mork uh, one time. So you can get it one time, and it's guaranteed, but you can only get it one time. So yeah, and I do believe that you can get the shield um, any normal loot drop ways of like killing enemies. However, that would take a very long time since there's no um, specific boss to drop this shield um, that is known yet. So I'm going to show you the good way to get it. Now, as you can see, this is a um, Anchin shield and it's elemental resistance. It matches the elemental, the elements of the last element damage received. So if you got shot by some corrosive, you would now have a 67% corrosive resistance shield and then a fire so on and so forth this is actually in reference to um a tv show starring robin williams in like the late 70s early 80s uh called mork and mindy and this shield actually does talk to you and they have a voice actor that's really close to robin williams which is kind of weird since he uh died re he died like a few months ago i think it was and the red text, I'm going to have to look on my screen really close because it's small on my screen, but hold up. The red text says, a face in the crowd, I fit right in. See, that might be in reference to something in the show. Um, But yeah, other than that, I have no idea what it means. So yeah. So we're going to hop into the video. I'm going to show you where it is. It is in the, as I said, in the Claptastic Voyage DLC. So you're going to have to head on in there and you're going to have to do part of it. You're going to have to do enough of the DLC that you get to where you're going to need to be. So you're going to want to head to the motherless board and you're going to see on the map. I kind of try and find it. It's right around. You see where that um, the yellow exclamation point for a mission is. It's right around there and you can follow my path to it if um that isn't good enough uh, instructions for you, which I would not be surprised if it isn't. So you're just gonna run through, um, run through the map like normal. There's gonna be like a few pockets of enemies. Um, they're not, they're not too hard for me at least. Uh, I am Nisha, who's completely overpowered, uh, but it's, it's not. It's pretty basic enemies. You can see that that exclamation point. That's where we're going. As I show a little more clearly, then. And so you're gonna you're gonna find the shield in a chest, and I believe that the shield never um, never spawns again in that chest. But you can always it always spawns the first time you look in that chest. I don't know if the chest spawns um, afterwards, since the chest has some has some like I think it, it had like greens and blues in it when I went. So you're gonna ha uh, ride the blue circuit, and this. Right there, as you saw, is where it's going to be a little different than normal travel. You have to ground pound out of that and then follow these uh, boosters. We're going to be going to that platform thing on the left that the, um, what am I saying? That the orange uh, two goes through. They're pretty. They're pretty all right jumps. Uh, yeah, there's one more uh, jump pad here that makes it pretty easy. This is going to send you to the top. Make sure you don't go into the orange stuff. There is a. Um, canister of weapons if you want to check that out so head over here and just drop down and make sure you don't die and there's the chest and you're gonna see the mork is gonna be in the left the left yeah the therapeutic mork that's what i got so i had do not have any gameplay of me fighting with it however i did i did fight a little bit with it and it against um some kind of basic enemies but it did pretty well so i i think it's an alright shield it has a pretty quick recharge rate however it's not a huge capacity and you can see when so whenever it gets depleted you take it off or you put it on it will talk uh, like and every time i've put it on it said good evening claptrap i think it is however um good evening claptrap yeah um but ha uh i do believe that it changes it has, it has a lot of stuff to say when you drop it or it gets depleted. So yeah, that's basically the video, guys. Hope you've enjoyed this. Uh, leave a like if you have, and I'll see you later.